Tasmania's multi-million dollar potato industry is under threat from weevils. They've infested northwest paddocks, gnawing through the vegetables and making them unsellable. But scientists are now working on a weevil bait. This is the damage the white-fringed weevil is inflicting on Tasmania's $100 million potato industry. They chew through potatoes, making them unsuitable for sale. In the past five years, I, I would have to say it would be uh, in the hundreds of thousands, if not, if not millions of dollars. The big nasty part of the problem is that you can't do anything about it once you see it in the crop. You've got to know it's there before you plant the crop and deal with it accordingly. The female insects each lay up to a thousand eggs which hatch into potato eating grubs. Farmers in Tasmania's northwest say the tiny pest is the biggest threat the potato industry has seen in years. Nathan Richardson, who runs a property at Thurlston near Devonport, says it's cost some farmers up to a third of their crop. And they've really been devastating effects um, to the tune of uh, you know up, upwards of somewhere near 25 tonnes per hectare of damage. Scientists in Hobart are about to start new research on the weevil in a bid to reduce its spread and the damage it's doing to farms on the northwest coast. You only need something like one grub per metre row of potatoes across the paddock to cause about 9% damage to the crop. Researchers will look specifically at whether there's a scent from potatoes that lures the weevil. We hope to identify what those compounds are and synthesise them and see if we can put them into a bait that will attract the weevils away from the roots. The research is expected to take three years. It's hoped the end result will be fewer potatoes in the reject bin. Tamara Glumak, ABC News.